Yeah, tunasema you are so jovial because of this such kind of love tunapata ndani ya studio right such now. Such kind of love. Yeah, yeah. tumepata vibe. A vibe. Tukavai show. Yeah. You understand? Hao vipi? Ni kwa time tuna sana. Unaipata kupitia Wai Mashariki ile Jumata 1:15 hadi 3:00 nusu na right now unapata burudani na noga zaidi kio kamilifu sababu jovial iko ndani. Jovial, how are you? Okay. Oh good. Mm. Eh niko poa msiko mbaya. Umeona? Hatari. Yeah, anasema unajua Una... anasema kwamba an artist should be a package. Unakaribishwa katika show yangu. Inabidi tu. Utajutia. Si ndio? Yes. Yeah, muone tu hapa ni kionjo hichi. <laughs> Just TV. Mimi nanunua ticket. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Tunabai nzima kwa ajili ya crew nzima. Kuja watu wapate burudani na kwaje. Watu kama 200 hapa tunawabaya. Ba, zile nafaa. Yeah. Uh, Jovel, <laughs> kama kawaida sisi tunafanyanga drip check mwanzo, tunaangalia bei gani umepiga. Simple. Tunao umewaka. Hata kuniandika. Tuanzie chini kwenye mguu. Mguu wa bei. Bei gani hapo? Ah, jamani. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, unajua wakati yeah. watanipiga mawe ni kidanganya. <laughs> Wanakuaga hivi. Ah, uh -huh. uh, it's not real. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I still look sexy and uh, beautiful. Yeah, yeah so uh ni ilikuwa ni I think ni uh, plug wangu ile tena bei. Uh -huh. Nataja bei. Eh, unataja bei. 10000. 10000. Hii uh, uh -huh. ni stele wangu aliniletea. Uh -huh. Sijui bei yake kama uh -huh. la ukweli. Uh -huh. Hizi pia yote ndio mimi style. Ah, nakupata. Yes. Alafu hiyo voice si mtu sijui ma mimi si mtu wa kucha walai. Yaani hata No, not hata kucha. Ring, mm. marings sijui nini. Ah, ring, so ring, ring ni ndoa. <laughs> eh, ipo <laughs> maipo iko wapi? Uh, sina, sina peti. Ah, bado. Lakini unaona kuna 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 viereni fulani hivi labda vinawaka so uh, eh, hivi ni mm. coated uh -huh. eh coated uh -huh. ni 20 20 yes so hapa tukipiga sabu za raka raka maana amebana kwenye ah, ni hapa tu na yeah. vipuli sema huko sijajua yeah. sema la kwa sababu tunalipana ga yeah. kwa ni ndo na ni style uh, yeah, yeah that's good that's amazing mitisha yeah, sana thank you Zor sana inspiration bend the tattoo this is my first tattoo uh -huh. eh, sema la kweli sijui na maanisha uh -huh. ni ribbon ah uh -huh. uh, Watongo walikuwa wanasema futa ibana sijui ni msanii inakaje but uh -huh. kila tatu inakuwa na history yake yeah. this is my first tattoo mm -hmm. when i was pregnant with my baby uh -huh. yes so mm -hmm. eh, so na nitakuja kuongeza lakini bado naam inabidi ni feel feel bado uh -huh. you know, wanasema kwamba tattoos are very addictive yeah i love yeah. tattoos uh -huh. yes naona ni ukweli kwamba wanasema watu ambao wana tattoos wanapenda pain is that true eh hey, uh, ni ukweli Sema tu kwa eni ah mimi na choraga tatu kama kuna either I'm in love uh -huh. and I want to express myself uh -huh. ni kama tu nikiingia studio alafu yeah. nikiwa na furaha nataka kuandika uh -huh. nikiwa na uzuni nataka kuandika pia yeah. ni kama a form of expressing myself oh kila yani ni usemaga hata mtu sichori tatu kama ujui kwa nini unachora yeah. sababu kuna watu unakuta wanachora tatu alafu baadaye ana regret after years later yeah. you need to know why you're getting a tattoo what's uh -huh. the what's alafu tatu, kila tatu inakuwa gani maana yake True. kama hii life no. is a beautiful struggle yeah. kuna kipindi ngoko na picha changamoto so uh -huh. nikaona tu yani yeah. struggle ya life ni ukiamka asubuhi yeah una unarauko unaenda kazini yeah. lakini mwisho wa mwezi yeah. tuna fry yeah, yes <laughs> that's what's up uh, jovo mimi ningependa kufua mtarehe 20 septemba mwaka 2013 unakumbuka nini eh tarehe 20 septemba 2013 unakumbuka nini hey, ni naomba nikumbushe yeah so 20, 20 september 2013 ndio uliweza kufungua kwa mara ya kwanza youtube channel ya kwako wow yeah hey, no, management not not that down <laughs> <laughs> Unakumbuka hiyo moment au ilikuwaaje? Eh kusema la kweli mimi sikumbukagi hizo kwa sababu yeah. mimi nakumbukaga breakthrough. Mhm. Mm Ukianza kukumbuka ulianzaje? Eh yeah. utakata tamaa. Mhm. Mm mimi sitakagi kuangalia ni hata yeah. mtu akiniuliza as, as much as nimekuwa na uh, miaka mingi katika industry yeah. lakini mimi semagi vinasema mimi nimeanza jana. Yeah. Sure. Muone kwa sababu breakthrough yangu ndio inamata. The struggles and all that it was just a, 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 a journey for yeah. me to be able to learn from it unaona yeah, yeah. but niki pale tumetusua ndo muda huo sasa eh kama tunatusua jana tumeanza mziki jana yeah nikisema jina dekeza what comes on your mind dekeza dekeza yeah. is my, i have a song in it so dekeza uh -huh. eh nilimtafuta garo boy mm -hmm. kwanza nilimtafuta kuna msanii mmoja nilimtafuta uh -huh. afu nakumbuka uh, instagram ilikuwa kuna ile mtu akivyu dm yako haionishi si naonesha kijicho hivi bas akanipiga kijicho hapo kalenga Yeah. You know but mm -hmm. uh, I think uh, my personality is Jovel for real. Jovel yeah. is not just a stage name. Ile yeah. kwanza ni jina nilipoa na mwalimu wangu kwa sababu yeah. nilihusiana na personality yangu. Mimi right. na feel kama huo muda uni feel yeah. then it's still okay. Yeah. Maybe inaweza kuwa shida ni mimi ama wewe true ndo ujui kitu kizuri. Yeah. Right. Unaona mambo ni mawili. Yeah. So at that time I felt like maybe I needed to push. Yeah. 
So nilimtafuta msanisti mtaja. Mhm. <laughs> Alafu nikamtafuta Aroboy. Aroboy akaja. Ah. Tukaimba vizuri. Fata tukusumbua na alipenda sana. Yeah. Yes. Ndio maana kwenye maana kwenye kwen, YouTube ya kwako umeandika kwamba breakthrough song ya kwako ni Dekeza. Eh, ni mandeke hivyo? Yeah, eh, itakuwa management. Yeah. But bado ni mimi. <laughs> ah, that's good. Ukawaja kwa badai. Mimi, kwa za ina iye jove wajui. Yeah. Uh, way back, hii upo Mombasa. Mm. I used to be a blogger. Uh, yeah, that's why your face is very plan. familiar. Yeah. Ila, nili, atukua, atujawai kukutana ila we used to communicate kwenye mtondo wa Facebook. Way back, hiyo ni kama 2015. Yes, yes, kukumbuka. Yeah. Big up to you, niliona umibukua so na aso, tuka your time, mbukua na yadikia tovuti kubwa sana and get to feature you. Thank you. Na waliezo kufatilia miziki na wakasema good artist na kuja kutusua uyu. Years later, meonekana, nuyo bosi ya namiliki kitu kikubwa sasa hivi. Kweli? Na, na mbaka lewa na kukubali. Kweli? Yeah, yeah. Mbaka atuku simbasi ya nini? 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 Yeah, nice, that's nice. Kumbia. Yeah, big up to you na tumangalia so umekuwa na consistency. Tukiangalia wasania mbao umekuwa na effort na wasania mbao umevuka boda, wasani wa kike, tukizungumzia Kenya. Ukosi kwenye list. Of course. Tukisema wasania mbao umefanya ata kolabu nyingi na wasania wanafanya vizuri the other countries ndo umefanya hizo. Yes. Imekuwaje? Hiyo grace inatokea wapi? Na ina, 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 kuna uraisi je unaipata kwa uraisi ama kuna hardness ambazo unapitia lakini na kisha mwisho siku inatokea? The funny thing, what people don't even know. I've never asked for a collab. Mm -hmm. I have never. All of those mega hit collabs zenye zimetoka sije kutafuta mtu. Wanatafuta gao wenyewe of which naweza sema ni neema ya Mungu. Mm -hmm. Ukiona collab uh, ambayo nimeitafuta itakuwa iko kwenye channel yangu hizo mm -hmm. zote wasije tafutaga i don't do that cuz uh, uh, i i want niki ukiona iko kwa channel yangu jioni nimeitafuta kwa sababu nataka kufanya kazi na wewe so uh naweza sema ni siwezi kuelezea kusema la ukweli kwa sababu kuna vitu vingine vina happen happen au mazinga umbo mimi mwenyewe pana shindwa eh what's really happening like and then i always give glory to god kwa sababu yeye ndo anajua kabisa ana mipango gani na vitu kama hivyo sababu there some people who who be questioning like kwani ana nini sina kitu kikubwa ndio lakini imebarikiwa naweza sema hivyo yes very talented hii nimeiuliza kwa nini coach yeah. back in 2020 ndio zana ama 2021 nilikuwa da nilikuwa kwa aba okay then ile kuepo mario na wasanii wengine wengi sana so wakati nilikuwa natajia wasanii wa Kenya ambao wanatamani kufanya nao kazi na ambao wanafanya vizuri hmm. walitaja jina lako Yeah. Nikitoka hapo nikielekea pia I think ni kwa Moko ama sijui ni Kimambo mm. same hey, thing kwanza huyo mtu yeah. wangu sana. Kwa kuwa nakutaja tena then nikakuwa nika like oh interesting yeah. kama hivyo wanamtambua msanii wa Kenya na kwenye 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 ukubwa wao kwenye level hiyo that's good na baadaye tuko na Miamoi kazaliwa mm. and stuff Miamoi ilifanya nini labda kwenye maisha yako maana it was a big song na ilisumbua sana. Especially for it is it. Yeah. Eh uh, ili naweza sema ilinipa umaarufu. Mhm. Mm Sema ilipa umarufu, wacha yeah. niongele upande uo. Yeah. Ilipa umarufu sana, kasabu kwanza, siku tarajia, na kumbwa kitu, mara kwanza nili mtafutaga mario. Yeah. Yeah. Haka nipa bei kubwa. Yeah. Siwa tikuwa sina, lakini yeah. kuna bei nyingine na bidi wekeze kwa kazi zingine. Yeah. Na ukibidi uki nikupa la hii yote, hafu kuna kazi kama kadhana za kuwekeza. Yeah. That was my point of view. True. So, ni kamambia tu kweli, kakangu kweli, naelewa uh, thamani yako, but uh, at this point, I have that money, but I don't think I'm going to invest on that part. Yeah. So tukanini kaka nikafanya tu shughuli zangu zingine ah yeah. uh, akaja kanitafuta saa mwenye. Yeah. Mimi atanishasahau. Yeah. Sababu mimi ukiniambia kai iwezekani mimi I'm very straightforward. Yeah, yeah. Kai iwezi iwezi. Yeah, so tukanini nikafuata tu shughuli zangu. Isiko amekuja Nairobi ndo yeah. aba ndo alimpigia. Like yeah. of you we need to like nikamwambia eh hey, tena nyinyi. Yeah. So we met and then we did memo. Memo ile nipo maarufu sana. Nipiga yeah. shows. Yeah. Sasa mtu wa Mungu shukurani. True. Yes. Kabisa kabla tuingilie kwenye kazi yako mpya na msanii ambaye leo nataka kumtambulisha pia. Uh, kwenye moja ya interviews ambazo umezifanya recently umesema <laughs> kwamba wewe utaki kufanya collaboration tena. Mm. Na una, una moment mbaya sana na masuala ya collaboration. Uh, ni nini labda the reason behind kwamba hiyo stack collab mimi. Stack yani yani. Mhm. Mm Sio ati sitakuja kufanya, yeah. nitafanya. Yeah. Kuna kuna hata EP inakuja bonga la EP, mimi na yeah. msanii fulani hata sitamtaja. Aha. Labda namjua. Mhm. Mm <laughs> inakuja, yani Aha. we feel like labda hii ndio itakuwa kwa ni muda wetu wa kufanya tu kitu cha mwisho zaidi, you know ne? Mm -hmm. yeah, ama kabisa, tuseme mm -hmm. hivyo. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But naweza sema yani collabs kwanza kitu cha kwanza, mm -hmm. eh wasanii wanasumbua. Mm -hmm. Wasanii wanasumbua sana. Alafu mm -hmm. nimekuja nikarealize upole wangu mimi as jovi unajua mi, mimi na mm -hmm. nilielekeza naweza sema katika miaka yangu ya mziki nilielekeza sana passion nikasahau pia ni biashara yeah hicho mm. ndo kitu kilichoniharibia sana ndo kitu na, na regret mpaka leo sasa yeah. nimekuwa mbaili nimekuwa kichwa kibaya vibaya sana sasa <laughs> ukija yeah. hata sitaki simu wewe mm -hmm. ongea na manager mm -hmm. na manager akija yapi akizingua 
Yaani yani sahi, unajua kama mtu mwenye asha face heart, asha face heart break, afu na mwambia mimi nakupenda. Yaani wewe ana wewe acha ujinga. Inakuwa hivyo, unaona eh? So like naweza sema it's just it was it was it was a good process for me. Yeah. Kwa sababu kuna watu watasema labda yeye huana shukurani. But then unajua kuna mtu mwingine mnakuwa gani? Nyuma hapazia huwezi kujua. Ni ni unakuta kuna mwingine labda um unasikizana mama masikizano fulani afu mtu mnaanza kuvutana yani kuna kuwa na dhulma kuna kuwa na vitu kama hivyo yeah. it's it's draining emotionally True. it's draining mentally and emotionally and i don't think i want to be in that space i have yeah. a few years left to, to do music and i want to be in the most amazing environment positivity me always say that my motto katika mziki wangu am rule yangu katika kufanya katika brand yangu ni protecting my sanity and that's the first thing i want to do kwa hiyo sasa kama sasa hizi niko na collabs nimefanya but zote ni za kwangu. Okay. Zote ni za kwangu. Na hata kama itakuja kutokea yani sasa inasumbua sasa kuficha. Maana ile inahusika na makaratasi inahusika. Yani hapo mm -hmm. sawa kwa sawa na wakili so, wangu. Yeah. Yani sasa inasumbua sio yeah. ndangani. Kwa sababu nimekataa so many big collabs even from Tanzania. Mm -hmm. Yaani mpaka wamesema hiyo dada umemfanyia nini? Yeah. Like wacha hiyo hivyo. Umesikia? Sasa hii inabidi tu tu confirm na flow ambaye amefanya collaboration right now <laughs> na Jovio. <laughs> Tujue ni dola ngapi? Maanisha Jovio hizi collab umefanya zimekuwa big hit. Umetengeleza hela ama nini imekufanya umekataa collab kabisa? Eh nimelalaga chini kwa hizo collab. Tuachie hapo. Nimelala chini yani jana nako anachapa ngoma ngoma huku mimi nalala kwa sakafu. Kwa hiyo tuachage hizo vitu kabisa. I don't want to go there. Sasa hapa leo hajatembea peke yake Jovio. Kuna nyimbo yao mpya ambayo ina control right now sana. Yeah. Amefanya na msanii kutoka Ardhi ya Burundi. Anaitwa Flow. Yeah. So Flow naomba uje kwenye kwenye stage right now watu kuone kwa mara ya kwanza familia wa Imashariki. Na pia tujue ulilipa dola elfu ngapi kwa ajili ya collaboration ya hii nyimbo. Ah. Maana Jovio sasa hivi hataki mchezo. Ah, sitaki mchezo. Yeah, wengine upande ule pale. Ah, nadhani hapo yuko sawa kabisa mwelekezi, sio? Tuko sawa, tumepata shot nzuri. Safi kabisa flow vipi? Safi kabisa. Uko poa? Uko fresh. Karibu sana tu for Ah, asante sana nimekaribia. Makaribia makaribisha uko poa? Ya ya, vizuri kabisa. Ah, sasa hivi umemsikia Jovi anavozungumza hapa. Amesema kwamba collaboration kidogo lazima makaratasi, lazima bei. Na mimi tunaona umevaa vyuma vinawaka sana mzee. E dola ngapi? 2020 2050 dola laki ngapi? Ah, hapana. Jovi ni mtu poa. Aha. Ukiona amesema hivyo ana sababu zake. Ya, ya, labda ata, ataenda kwenye deep sana wa, watu watamuelewa. Yeah. Lakini wewe hujalipia. Oh, tuna makubaliano yetu ambayo alikuwa ni mazuri sana. Ya. Yeah. Wow, kwa mazuri inamaanisha ina, ina nini labda ukiweza kuifufanua kidogo? Oh. Yeah. Tumekutana tukaelewana, tukawa tume, tume vibe zetu zikawa zimeingiana vizuri. Aha. So ikawa hivyo. Ah, yeah. Nipitia channel ya kwako na ona umefanya kazi nyingi sana ambazo zinafanya vizuri sana. Yeah. Na nikaona tofauti na wasanii wengi wa Burundi na Rwanda, maana nyingi nchi jirani sana, wanaimba nyimbo kwenye kwenye lugha. Lakini wewe nime notice kwamba unachanganya na naona pia uko tofauti sana pia umeingia mpaka kwa vibe za mapiano kiasi and stuff like that. Yeah. Nini inakufanya kidogo unakuwa msanii wa tofauti na wengine? Nini umekiona? Bao unajua muziki ni biashara mm -hmm. na biashara zote mtu anakuwa na target zake. Unaweza una, una, una target za kusema nafanya na biashara hapa Nairobi. Mwingine ana target za kufanya biashara mpaka Dubai, sijui wapi, yeah. Mombasa sijui wapi. Yeah. So ni target ambazo mimi nimejiwekea. So mm -hmm. nikiimba lugha yetu Nam. kuna sehemu haitafika. Nam. Lakini nikiimba hizi lugha za wenzetu kama lugha zenu na za yeah. wengine ndio maana nakuja hata hapa tunaelewana vizuri. Ya. Lugha gani maybe kubwa ina, inatumika kule Burundi ambao uh, Kirundi Kirundi. Yeah. Ah, nikupata. Wasanii wa Kenya ambao wanacheza sana upande kule. Oh, ni Jovio. Naam. Otil Brown. Naam. Na Bien. Ah, yeah. ndio wasanii ambao uh, wanacheza wana sana. Yeah. Na na Meja. Na Meja. Mm. Ah, that's interesting. So right now tunaona umefanya kitu na Jovio. Tutarajie sasa mtafanya ngoma nyingine na nyingine maana kwa wasanii wengi ambao wanafanya kazi na Jovio unapata wanapenda kufanya kazi naye back to back maana anakuwa na chemistry nzuri sana na wasanii tuseme male artist yes, anakuwa yes. na chemistry nao nzuri sana wewe <laughs> yeah. pia tutarajie labda kuna kingine na kingine mtakifanya ama ndio hivyo <laughs> Jovio ni mtu poa kwa, kwa watu ambao haja baatika kwa karibu naye naam na nafikiri kuna kitu amemiss Jovio ni mtu poa ni, ni mtu humble sana anakaribisha watu vizuri So la, lakini hataki mtu amsumbue. Hicho <laughs> hicho watu wakijue. Wa so kufanya <laughs> naye kazi tutafanya nafikiri Mungu akipenda. Naam. Sababu ni ni mtu poa. Tunafanya ah. kazi, kuna kazi itaanguka. Huu ndugu yangu. Huu ah, ni ndugu yangu. Naam. Yaani mumpokee tu. Huu mtakapomuona Jovio. Yeah. Huu kwanza tunakutafutia jina la huku yeah. la Kenya. Huu ni huu ukiniona mimi ukimsikia amekuja Kenya, unjue 
I'm a little rasmi na jevo. Ah, this is good. my brother. Yes, that's yes. good. Hii ndio love tunayozungumzia na tunasema kwamba Afrika Mashariki needs to get back the way it was. Yeah, yes. And kwa tunayozungumza hii same tunasema kwamba for sisi kupambana na wenzetu wa West ama South Africa lazima tushikane kama East Africa. Yeah. Yeah. Nchi moja tu it can't. It can't. Na yeah, this yeah. is what Jove anaonyesha tayari na love yeah, unapata kwamba tunavuka board na msikio tunasonga zaidi. Yeah. So right now me talk control ilikuwaaje uh, inspiration behind it na baka ukahisi kwamba it's good ile ile ifanye na Jovio. Oh kwanza naweza nikasema kitu kimoja. Yeah. Mimi ilikuwa ndoto yangu kufanya kazi na Jovio. Aha. Ya na na, na Mungu Naam. na mshukuru sababu amenitimizia ndoto kabla <laughs> si, sija sija haso sana sana Naam. sana ya. Naam. Sababu nakumbuka nilikuwa na recording ngoma zangu za kwanza kwanza. Naam. Ikawa imetoka jeraha. Naam. Sasa watu tulikuwa tulikuwa nao Sawa mimi ni mtu anapenda kufuatia ngoma Nam. sana ambazo za, za watu ambao wanajua yani mtu kama anajua kuimba lazima ni, ni msachi ni ni, 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 yeah. ni jue amefanya kazi gani Nam. so ilivotoka tu hivi ni eh hey, nikaisikiliza nikaacha hata kurecord ni maana hiyo notification nikaangalia nilivosikia nikamwambia huyu mwanamke anajua kuimba Nam. So watu walikuwa hapo wakasema nini unasema na tuna record ma producers na, na watu wengine. Nam. Nikamwambia sikizeni ngoma kabla mimi sijaendelea kurecord. Tukasikiliza ngo hiyo ngoma nikamwambia huyu mwanamke anajua Nam. na yushi Mungu asikie maombi yangu ni hivi nikafanya naye kazi Nam. so nashukuru Mungu yeah. sababu ndoto yangu imetimia yeah, yeah. you're kaya living kaya. a dream right now yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> that's an extra blessing you understand yeah, yeah, yeah. so right now controller imetoka uh, inafanya vizuri video unaona ni very expensive mfanya director mzuri Jessica Torres uh, gharama labda ya video imekukosti vipi uh, <coughs> imekosti sababu <laughs> umeiona hivi mm. na waka tumetumia vitu vingi sana so imekosi lakini siwezi nikataja sababu watu watasema tunajivuna au tunafanya vitu <laughs> vingine <laughs> lakini imekosi bei kabisa Nam. watu wanajua video ukiona hii video ni video ambayo ina quality kubwa Nam. kiasi kwamba mtu yeah. ukitaja bei atasema labda umejiongezea kuna zile wa Afrika wanasema akitaja kitu anaongezea sufuri <laughs> nyuma <laughs> so yeah. sasa kila mimi ni semo hivyo but yeah. video ime ime do cost hela mm. yeah. yeah big up to you big up kwa kufanya kazi safi kama hii uh, kutokia leo kuch na mimi ni imeingia kwenye playlist yeah. yeah. yes. yes. na ama piano eh hey, god bless you yeah. 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 this is good na yeah. tunaendelea kusupport kila siku watu unaona sana so right now unaona nani anazungumza hapa na mshiki Samoke yeye anasema Jove lameweza sana tu alafu nani mimi anazungumza spoiler anasema ni shabiki mgeni Uh, nani mimi nazungumza hapa na mcheki uh, nani huyu uh, Charlie anasema Ken Kalunda DJ Kucha hello from KB Mwe and Charles Baba Jovel play for me by show yongo maikufa Jovel mwenyewe yuko hapa leo mbona una request nyimbo zako safi kabisa so 